And welcome back to this play of Renome 3 part 21. Yes, this is part 21. And here we have to persuade people. We have to persuade Levin and then some other guy, militia. Hello, hello, hello. Talking to Levin. The man behind this desk looks eerily spider like. He sees us you up with pity eyes. I'm internal and fair supervisor Levin. Impressive job title. We need your permission to go on Mayor Knight's quest. So you want permission to go on a mission, eh? Well, it's a problem. There's a lot of paperwork that I need to fill out first. There is a filing fee for, for those papers. Give me 1000 coins and I'll give you permission. When you have the money, I'll be ready to help you. We are willing to risk our lives to help our town, you had better help us. Perhaps I should, but I won't, if you are some sort of hero maybe, but as it is I must insist on my fee. What? Oh come on, where shall I? My thousand. One thousand, everything. Oh well, time to pillage and loot, loot and pillage. The other guy, Garrison, is the steel. Now. Where shall I get that money from? It's impossible, okay, I forgot where should I do. Robo, robo. Hello, we can stop them. I can stop them. <coughs> Surprise, Commander Cory. She's in the barracks at the north end of the city. Where is Cory? Barracks. These are the barracks. Commander Cory. Huge barracks. Ah, there she is. Hello. Hello. Commander Cory. The garrison commander of Sherry McWash is you skeptically. She seems unwilling to give you, give you some of her valuable time, but she is resigned to it. Commander Cory. Mayor Knight says that I need your permission to be given the troglodyte scroll for delivery. She frowns. I can't believe Mayor Knight wants to give you this mission. You want permission? Prove your word. Troglos have an enormous altar in the hills east of Angel's Rest. It blesses them, makes them much nastier in a fight. Find it and destroy it, and my permission is yours. The problem is that it's sure to be magical. You, you may need to perform the ritual of sanctification. Where can I get the ritual of sanctification? All that holy mumbo jumbo is beyond me. I haven't the foggiest idea how to destroy the altar. I tell you who might though. Talk to Nidia. She is in soft fort. Tell her my name. She served with me once. If she knows anything about how to destroy the truck altar, she'll tell you. It does the last help you get to me. <coughs> Do you know anything? It's up a long one in the mountains of Angel's Rest. Trollos use altars and magical energies themselves. They're big magical charge things and destroy the victory. Our quest has been destroy altar for Cory. Alright. Now. Nidia. We need to find Nidia. Nidia! Nidia. Guards. Fine. Leave. Leave. Wait, where is the soft port? I'm. Far port? Or far port? No. I won't. Don't find no animal philosophy. Where is it? I need the ritual of sanctification. The ritual of sanctification. Yeah. Oh, great troglodytes. Troglots. Troglots. Dites, dites.
Oh, five of them. There we go. And no one died. <coughs> Not kill him, please. God. Why? 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 Oh, great. No, one is all fucking bitch. Come on, kill him. My voice is strange, isn't it? I may be sick, but I don't. Probably not. Get to him. Give him peace of your justice. Will you die of him? There we go. Stone spiral. Large shield. Poor chain mail. I should probably loot stuff and sell it. Ooh, iron chain mail. Okay, I'll do. You're gonna go selling stuff now. And large shields. Sell this bronze great sword. Now let's take this. Wait, wait. <laughs> nothing. And another bronze great sword. There we go. Um, do some shopping. I don't want. There is a group of guards based in Shrimi, from this stretch of road. Get close to them, they stop and warn you that a lot of trouble lights are now forward to the northeast. Don't go up there, the captain says. They'll stab and burn you, take your stuff and eat you. See, it happen lots of times, so watch out. <coughs> Save it. As. <coughs> oh, gods! What does that? Several of farms are clustered here, enjoying the protection of a circular stone wall. Empire soldier Eva Lord have been stationed here to protect the Sharim's food source. You approach, but since they don't recognize you, don't, they don't let you in. Let's sell my stuff. Yeah, Patcher. Oh, where is it? Stuff. Excuse me. Trainings. No, where is that? Mage. Guy that sells armor also. Hello, I have more stuff for you. Can we do some trading? <coughs> yes, we can. Sell, 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 sell. Is this map of Cardinal. And sell. Well, I got a pretty decent amount. Pants! Sell your pants! No, I sold my pants. I have no more pants. Craps. Give me back my pants. There. <coughs> uh, gods. Urgh, growling. Okay, very soft port to find that media. Nice ah, soft port. 90 miles north. Counter a traveling merchant. He spent 100 the weight of a pack filled with an amazing variety of stuff. He says, greetings, I wander the roads around Shrimik, selling my wondrous whales to all the others. Care to look, yes. Yeah. Drake skin gloves. What? Yeah. Please, give us passage. We need to go to soft part. A rock smashes into the road in front of you. It's eight inches across. One of the creatures emerging from the woods through it without exertion. That shows mist, but they clearly prepared to try again. You, you can help recognize the creature you see. It's smelly, hairy, wears fur, and it's over 12 feet tall. It's a giant. It's hard to believe, though. The Empire wiped all the giants off the surface a century ago. What's one doing here? Oh, great gods.
Oh, great gods again. Kill their wolves. Great gods. Oh, I'm gonna slay your wolves, at least. Aha, oh, you're wolfless. Wolfless bastard. Yes, just miss. Continue missing. Again, the ice lances. Yes! We downed the hill ones. Come on, missile, be a successful. Yes! Bluff! I didn't expect hill giants here. I really didn't. I thought there would be trouble. 63 damage. Damage quickly by the power of Grey Skull. Hey, boy. Mass healing. Mass killing, mass healing. Spray that acid. Stop hitting so hard. Guys, you start hitting better. Haste him. You freaking haste him more. <coughs> 69. Yeah, this is awesome. Do they leave anything? Nothing. Why? They're giants. Softport. Go to the softport. Where is Nidia? Nidia. Nidia. Ah, there we go. The temple is unusually lovely and carefully built for a shrine in the back of the town. The floor is precisely cut mark and mosaics decorate the wall. Building it must have been quite expensive. Hello, are you Nidia? Nidia, yes. You meet a priestess. She is counting several piles of gold on the top of the altar. When you approach, she scoops it all into a pouch. I'm Nidia. Welcome. I heard that you might know the ritual of sanctification. She looks suspicious. Who told you to ask me about that? Cordy told me to speak with you. She gets upset. You can't imagine why. Her? I told her I didn't want anything to do. She pauses to regain her composure. Oh yes, look, I'd teach it to you for a fee, but I don't know it. I know who does though. There's a hermit in a hut at the north end of the mountains to the north. He knows the spell. I can't get it out of him, but you might be able to. Now go away, please. Highly agitated, she turns away. What? Great! Ah, oh, find the hermit! Find the hermit! Well, I hit my microphone. No, hermit, I'm coming. I want to do it down again. The stone bridge is quite a feat of empire engineering. It arcs a full hundred feet over the river. At the north end, there is no road. Only barely settled wilderness. To the south is old port and roads leading back to civilization. Alright. Oh, North at the mountains. Is that. Ah, you can figure out. Somebody hit something. Beware, ogres. Shrek is here. <coughs> Hermit, you walk around the bend in the valley and realize that you have stumbled into an encampment of ogres. As you seize them up and prepare to fight, the ground starts to shudder. You need your feet. A massive pale creature starts working its way out of the ground near you. You are so distracted by its appearance that you don't notice the ogres moving to encircle you. Oh, oh, those guys. Crap. Oh, I'm gonna die! I'm gonna die now! We're gonna die! We can't survive this! We're gonna die by the love of God! Or maybe not! Or maybe yes! Or maybe yes! He's dead! He's dead! Goodbye! Goodbye! You die! You will die also! And you will die now! Smite! Look, they lined up for an execution! The shooting squad will take it out. But yes. 
Glass out, Cold Beasts. Cold Beasts. It was unsuccessful. Cold Beasts again. <laughs> oh, yeah, you dare to lose it to me. I have some fireballs. And you're dead. Find out what I needed to find out. Look, I need to talk to you. I really need to. Yes. No, Anama, no, no, no. We don't want to hear your fellow Anama. What's that? You meet a group of soldiers and a priest. No, Nama again. I don't want no Nama philosophy. <coughs> okay, let's try it again. The last time we went the wrong way. And now we have to go here. No, no, I'm not trying this one again. Here. There is a narrow footpath leading it up into the mountains. The footprints look fresh. Fortunately, they also look human sized. Ah, that is it. Oh, I guess this is it. Hello, Hermit. Hello. This is a nice place to live. He even has a sign. <laughs> Go away. <coughs> you enter the Hermit's hut. A single adobe chamber with a rough stone floor. A simple altar, altar has been set up by the north wall and junk is scattered all through the room. It's made like its occupant hasn't waited for a while. Hermit. Ah, hello. Nice place you have here. Hermit. You meet a pale, desperately thin man. He has a torn, threadbare clothes and a worn face. He looks very upset that you intruded upon his solitude. I don't want you here, he rasps. Ninja mentioned you can perform the ritual's sanctification. Can you teach me how? He looks nervous. Ah, you want the ritual? An empire priestess came to me, but she only wanted the ritual in order to sell it. That is not becoming. There is only one reason I do not expel you now. What reason is that? He watches you carefully for any signs of your true intentions. intentions. I speak with you because the ritual can be a powerful tool for good, and I feel bound to share it if that is how it will be used. So tell me, how do you plan to use the ritual? Well, against the troglodytes. He sits. Those humanoids are pests. They bug my solitude. I'll teach you the ritual, but only if you leave. He explains the ritual of, of sanctification. It's simple, but requires great exertion. Then, when, he, when done, he turns away. Great. I want to be alone. Leave me be. Leave me be. I'll leave you. I'll leave you, man. Right, I learned literal of scientification. Goblins, you spot a group of goblin raiders. The moment they cover the little thief, see you, they flee. You try to give chase, but they are driving you on their spindly little legs. Okay. Go to Angel's Rest. Alter to sanctify. That's this. Sign. Lorelei North East. Remic area. Get, get lost. East. A mineral angels. Lorelei East. East, really? East. Rest. Angel's rest. No, no, no shopping. Yeah. And near Angel's rest. <coughs> you enter the city of Angel's rest. The crocked, cracked walls and nervous guards mark this small town as a primary target of troglodyte attacks. The smell of sulfur hangs over them. Well, we arrived here at night, and we shall continue this next time. Until then, bye-bye.